Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Now, today is the first first day release of chapter 9. Now, if I were you, I would suggest to read chapter 9 immediately already while there's still the campaign, alright? But before before I go into detail, I just want to say that there is a little bit spoiler in this video. So if you don't want, then yeah, you, you can step out. But like, I'll, I'll put like a huge warning timestamp on... Uh, like where's the part that has a spoiler but it's mostly about second anniversary nothing nothing spoilerish about the story and everything so yeah it's like 10 percent spoiler okay anyways going going back uh basically what this campaign does is like you have to finish chapter 9 so that you can get a special cg now the special cg is obviously for collection collection purposes i'm not really sure if it could count like onto any achievement but as far as i know there's none okay so how do how do you complete this one basically there are like nodes all right around the nxx file since i already completed i can't show you but just complete all the way until the end of chapter 9. So you can see like all of these are like related to the story. I won't do dive into it. So here, complete all episode 9 and complete 3 anomaly tasks. Okay, 3 anomaly levels. And then optional is uh, finish uh, 5 stages. So yeah. And then you get extra S chips around 650x S chips. If you complete it all the way from chapter 1 all the way to chapter 8. Note that this achievement only appears once. So if chapter 10 comes, they're going to release another campaign like this. But... You can only claim this once. Okay, so if you claim this right now and then chapter 10 comes, you cannot claim it again. Okay, But come chapter 10, they're going to release a new set of like this and a new CG, something like that. So this will keep keep on going starting from chapter 9 onwards. Okay, So this affects all the way until um, next chapters. Okay, Next, try to, uh, try to make use of the double NXX. So what does this do mean? If you tap this one, it goes to your NXX space. So again, how to unlock NXX, you have to complete chapter 4. Or episode 4 of the main story so you can see here there's like double arrow right which means that you can uh, you can get the uh, more more funds uh, basically more funds and then here is the more important one so you, instead of uh, this used to be 60 and then it increases to 120 confidence level and then materials you get uh, double so it increases the uh, the rewards so as much as possible try to take advantage of it try to log in back to the game every x hours when it's done okay what does confidence level do confidence level is basically your exp towards this one uh this uh study level okay it's important because every level after level 50 you can unlock this node and this node can help you in uh, increasing all your cards as in all so it's very helpful for the beats so do take advantage of it okay now <laughs> Aside from the main story, now is a good opportunity to farm in anomaly stages because they announced that the shards, the shard drop is gonna be increased increase rate. So if you check here, anomaly, let's say chapter nine, uh, you can see there's like a up, yeah. Where is it? Oh, it doesn't say. Yeah, it basically says the up up means uh, increased drop rate. So there's a chance for you to get two shards in in the same debate round. Okay, so try to take advantage of it so that you can get uh. You can get the SR shards faster so that uh, you can yeah, collect more cards and yeah, etc. If you're lacking SR cards, then uh, now's a good time to farm for them. Oh, but another another thing to take advantage in this in this anomaly stages is while while your main story has um, decreased decreased cost. Okay, it used to be ten, now it's five. So as much as possible, try to finish the main story so that you can immediately unlock. Uh, Anomaly Stage 9. Now, why am I emphasizing this? Is because starting from Episode 7 of Anomaly Stage to Episode 9, you can you can farm for S rank materials. So you can. This is Vince S rank materials, uh, Mario's S rank materials, everybody's S rank materials. Okay, including the uh, this one, the impressions. So there's a chance for you to farm for the Tier 3 impressions, which is like the hardest thing to farm. So, uh, yeah. So there, are, of course, there are other ways to get these materials, um, such as uh, the shop. Okay, uh, you can check where to get in your inventory. So like you can get it from your field work, field work advanced shop. So if you haven't unlocked advanced shop, just level level uh, the normal stage, this one. The basic case needs to be level 25 in order for you to unlock the advanced case. Once you unlock the advanced case, you can open this shop. And that's where you can retrieve your S rank materials. But of course, it's limited stock a month. So yeah, uh, that's one way of getting um, the third rank. Uh, third tier materials now why am i saying to to pre-farm these materials is it's a huge spoiler if you don't want anything about second anniversary then i'll see you in the next video but if you're here to stay for second anniversary because i know everyone's fucking hyped for it then i will continue okay now come second anniversary just like in first anniversary they're going to release this like clickbait ish post about like 
oh, this event can give you X rewards. Be careful. Do not get clickbaited. Read carefully. Okay. I will not translate all of it, but I want to emphasize uh, one thing. Okay. So second anniversary, they're going to tell you, oh, you can get like 72 wishes and 42 limited wish, blah, 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 blah. Don't believe in all of that. Okay. Read carefully. Don't, don't be like the clickbait Genshin Keme Keme. Okay. Next. You can see in this one, they have a special, uh, special uh, event. It says here, anniversary card, card, uh, card feeding task. Okay. That can give you 400 S chips. Now, it sounds good. Like, well, all I have to do is just feed my cards and get S chips. Yes, sir. It's a yes, sir. Okay. Because the first requirement, obviously, is you have to get the SSR card. Now, I'm talking based on my experience in my, in my Taiwan server. Since Taiwan server is really, really close to CN. So, I would say it's like a premonition thing already. Okay. Now, do note that Global can have a chance to change the stuff. So, it's taken with a grain of salt. Okay. So, this is what it looks like based on my... Uh, when I was playing it in the Taiwan server. Basically, it tells you that uh, you need to finish the card feeding task of the of the second Adiv SSR cards. And there are seven tasks. Now, there are more than uh, seven tasks. I think it's like eight to nine tasks. So you just need to finish seven, then you'll be fine, okay? So these tasks being uh, one, two, and three, which is level 40, level 70, level 100. That one's very doable, right? That's three. Then four, five, six, seven, okay? So this one, it says ascend, ascend to the second and ascend to the third. So basically, if you ascend all the way to level 100 then you immediately finish five tasks but this is where the a little bit harder task comes in we're just leveling up one skill to level six and leveling two skills to level six so those other two tasks is the slightly challenging one but if you're low-key intense there's another uh there's another task for you to do remember what i said you just need to do seven out of eight or nine so that means there are two tasks for you to spare so you can either do like uh level up two skills to level six or one skill to level 6 and then to level 10. Yes, there's actually a task that tells you that you have to level up one skill to level 10. And it, and that's where you get your S chips. So the 400 S chips that I've shown a while ago, this one. Yeah, this part, the, four, the 400 S chips, that's actually divided across all the guys. So one guy of second anime SSR is 100 S chips. And under that 100 S chips, you split into this. Basically, this one is uh, 50 S chips and then this one is uh, another 50 S chips. So it's 100 S chips per guy, something like that. So this is a proof of what I did in, in my Taiwan server account to clutch for second anime event. It's basically, uh, I, I did two, two skills to level six, and then for the sake of S chips, I, I just drag, drag my way to level 10 one of the skills. So yeah, that's about it. Yeah, hopefully this will help you to like pre-farm for second anniversary or this, as a lot of people are super hyped for it. And yeah, it's one of the, it's, it's the anniversary cards. <laughs> no way you can miss that one. So yeah, hope this video helps and I'll see you on the next one. Bye!